Pork in cold storage is 14% above where it was a year ago. Pork reported in cold storage at the end of September, coming in at more than 537 million pounds. Beef coming in at a record more than 522 million pounds. That's up 19% for the year. In total, red meat coming in at more than a billion pounds, 17% higher than the same time last year. The McRib is back at McDonald's, but the fast food giant says it will be the last season it offers the seasonal sandwich. The sandwich featuring pork was put on pause back in 2005, but then brought back the restaurant issuing a press release suggesting it could be the sandwich's final hurrah. And while you're celebrating that sandwich, here's a bit of a history lesson. According to the University of Nebraska, researchers within the Meat Sciences Department actually created the McRib. Meat Science Research got its start more than 100 years ago, but today that department continues to serve up new products for appetites across the globe. We've got a long tradition of, of meat science research. Um, technology behind the McRib was developed at University of Nebraska, identifying the flat iron steak, you know, or a couple things that some of my uh, predecessors and, and Ameritai faculty from our department worked on. But one, the way I look at it is we really want to figure out how to make the products be as tasteful as it can be, to be as safe as it can be, as, uh, add as much value as we can, and to make it last as long as we can. The McRib made its debut in Kansas City, Kansas back in 1981 when McDonald's brought the McRib back in 2019. It first returned to 10,000 of McDonald's 14,000 U.S. locations. Then in 2020, it was reintroduced nationwide.